Yesterday, a group of hooliganism who claim to be youth leaders from the whole country addressed a press conference at, Naj uh, uh, at Katonga claiming that uh, they are youths of this country. Youths of this country from where we don't know. In as far as FDC, we as FDC members are concerned, anything concerning FDC, we have the headquarters, the party headquarters, which is in Najanankumbi, not in Katonga. It was supposed to be, if there's a press conference, it's supposed to be called for by the, by the, uh, by the National Youth Council, the youth chairperson, who wasn't even aware of the press conference of the so-called uh, youths in Katonga. So as West Nilers, we want to dis uh, uh, disassociate ourselves from those called youths from Katonga who claim that people from, uh, from the nationwide are there. And therefore our message to them is that let them respect the constitution. They should use their effort to mobilize the youth in this country to do something better. FDC is one party in this country that which is very organized up to the grassroots. The current leadership of FDC is working based on the constitution. They have respected and hold the constitution. And if there's anybody who feels whatever they are doing is out of the constitution, we have the National Delegates Conference, which is going to be there in November. We have the National Council sitting, the National Council meeting, which is, be, which is going to be held on Friday at Najanankumbi, where we are supposed to sit and address some of these issues and some of these concerns are supposed to be addressed. We West Nilers, we are rallying our support behind our party leaders. And the constitution states it clearly. For the party secretary general and the party president, the chairperson to be sanctioned, it must be done through the Delco <coughs> conference, which I stated earlier on. Anything without that must not be respected, and therefore we have been guided by the principle of the party. FDC is not a poor party. party. <coughs> FDC, if FDC is badly in need of money, we'll never run to go and get money from NRM. We have party members who have been supporting this party right from the start when this party was, was what? Was formed. Up to now, they have been supporting the, the party. So anything to do the money scandals, let's try to resolve that. We resolve it to be discussed by the, the, the party head, uh, headquarters. It is an internal wrangle. The party has its structures to handle that. There are standing committees who are to resolve that. They will grow old, but FDC will never grow old. We as youths, from West Nile, we are still strong behind FDC, we know that. If they're trying to lead us to other party like NUP or NRM, we are not going to be part of them. We shall still remain FDCs in West Nile. People,